How's it going guys? Welcome back to another video on the channel. In today's video we're going to be doing my fantasy Premier League team. Now this video is coming a bit late with the Premier League already kicking off. It is the Saturday night after the first round of fixtures and there's been some good games today. You've seen Spurs, Harry Kane scoring two. Uh, last night we had Van Dijk scoring and a few other players. I think Salah got off the mark straight away. But what I'm going to do is show you me building my team. Um, hopefully I can do a bit better than the past. And let's just get straight into it. If you do enjoy the video, please do like and subscribe. And there will be a lot more FIFA videos coming. And maybe a Premier League predictions video. If you would like to see that, please let me know down in the comments. And let me know what your fantasy Premier League teams are. But let's get straight into it. So we have it set up here. We've got 100 million to spend. Um... I'm just going to go straight off the bat. I want to get in. Um, I want to get in Harry Kane. So we're going to add Harry Kane. And I think I want to get in. I think Pookie is quite expensive for a player that's never played in the Prem at 6.5. I think we're going to get Origi. 5.5 might play a bit more with Mane just coming back from the African Cup of Nations um, we'll stick him in there and we want a bit of a cheaper striker as well so I'm not sure how much Mosey Keane is so he's 7 that's quite expensive I think um, but it does look like a solid solid player for for Everton so we're going to stick him in they have uh, they had Crystal Palace today and uh, Drew so yeah maybe from that game he's not the man to put in maybe we will look elsewhere um, Gray could be a good player to put in Gray does seem to get a few goals Dini as well um, what we will do is we're just looking for that cheaper alternative we'll go for uh, yeah we'll go for We'll go for Gray, Andre Gray from Watford. So there's the three attackers, not bad. Um, Origi obviously did score the other night, so maybe he will do well. Um, that man is 12 million sterling, so he scored a hat trick today. I'm just going to have to add him 12 million. We'll see if we can afford him at the end, but sterling is going to make it into the team. The another player who did score today, McGinn and Ndombele so could go for either of them but I think what we're going to do is we're going to look elsewhere we're going to go for see Gross is an interesting one Suzuko never seems to score we need to have a good blend of midfielders who score but also midfielders who are just quite solid. Um, one player I can think I want to get in straight away is Van Dijk, 6.5. And unfortunately, we're going to get in Trent as well. Who's cheaper, Trent or Robertson? I reckon it. Yeah, so we're going to go Trent because he does seem to. Um, he seems to take the set pieces. We'll just stick in the two players there. So you can only have three from each team. So we've got Trent and Van Dijk and Origi. Um, we will look at bringing a goalkeeper in so who do we think is going to keep the most clean sheets I'm going to say Edison so he's 6 how much is De Gea 5.5 so based on clean sheets we're going to go for Edison that brings us up to two City players now all we need is another goalkeeper so we'll go for Tom Heaton's quite a good one but I'm trying to think who's a really good goalkeeper who plays for a team. I think Fabianski, although they did get beat 5-0, we're going to add him to the team. Fabianski and Edison, we've got 41 million remaining, so it's going to be a bit tricky to see how we uh, fill up the rest of this team. I wouldn't put this man in if it was the game against Man United. I'm going to add Ross Barkley into the team because hopefully he does nothing against Manu, but he's going to make it into the midfield. Should score a lot of goals under Frank Lampard. I think he will do well. I'm um, sorry. Oh, and the the watch is going off. 
Um, we'll turn that down. Up next, we're going to have Spurs player, I think. We're going to go for Vertonghen. 5.5 does seem to be quite an attacking player, so could get us a few um, goals. Another player we're going to go for is Ndidi. So the Leicester midfielder at 5 million. Um, should do well under Brendan Rodgers. Um, Brendan Rodgers is first full season. So Ndidi is a brilliant, brilliant player for his age. I think he's only going to get better and better. So he's going to slot into that position there. We need four more players. So we've got 24 million. Just over 5 million each. Um, or we could obviously go out. Spend a bit more cash. I'd love to put De Bruyne in because he got goals and assists. Um, we'll see what we can do. So we could just put in De Bruyne. We have to remember that we will have some players on the bench as well. So Ake, I think we'll put in. He will be a bench player for us. Um, got 10 million left. So midfielders. Who can we get under 5 million? 5 million a piece. Someone. Solly March. Quite quite a good player. Um, we'll look a bit more into it. Kapue. Um, Gwendouzi at 4.5. I think he will play. Doesn't really score too much. Wilshire as well. 5 million. If he stays fit. Wilshire could be a good pick. Um, I think that is who we could go for. Wilshire. Could actually get a few assists playing from that deep line midfielder position. Now it's the final defender's time. So 5 million is all we have left. We've sort of rushed through the team selection here. But I'm pretty happy with the way it's turned out. And I feel like a Burnley player would be a good pick. Um, <clears throat> so like a Tarkovsky or Ben Mee. I think what we're, doing, what we're going to do is go Tarkovsky. Now, could there be any improvements to this team? We've got De Bruyne, Sterling, Trent, Origi, um, Damari, no, Andre Gray, Barkley, who could do uh, quite a lot. That is the team that I've gone for. Um, hopefully, I will be making lots of changes to the team because I seem to forget quite often to make any changes if you do have any suggestions please let me know down in the comments we're going to enter the squad um, we're going to call it Onaf um, on Tico Madrid um, that's what my five side team used to be favourite team there we are and we're going to enter that squad so we're going to miss out on the first week of points but that is the team we've gone for. The total plays 5 million. If you would like to get involved, go to the Premier League website where there's fantasy football. Um, it's great fun. Great fun to have with your friends. And I think there's a, actually a massive league where there's prizes up for grabs, things like that. So make sure you just get involved. I think that is how we're going to set the team up. Potentially we can put Wilshire in for Ake. Get five in midfield. So you want to have less uh, defenders, the better, I think. Um, we've maxed out there on attackers and midfielders. But that is the end of the video, guys. If you did enjoy, please do like and subscribe for more FIFA content and more football content coming to the channel. Thanks very much for watching. I'll see you later.